Hey, what's going on YouTube and welcome back to another fun video. Guys, in yesterday's video, we did a box battle and we found a bunch of good stuff in that box, including these two silver wartime nickels, which are 35% silver, and we found a buffalo nickel. Oh, oh, oh. You did not. Right, let me see. You ready? Yeah. Let me see. Are you kidding me? Wait. Are you freaking kidding me? He got a buffalo. Comeback has begun. Are you kidding me? There's no way. Wait, let's see. Is that going to date? Ah, oh, it's I have to look at dateless. It. Dateless buffalo, but it's a buffalo nonetheless. And I told you at the end of the video I was going to give you the date on the buffalo nickel because it's so worn down. So today, we're gonna reveal what that date was. Guys, I am gonna tell you it's over 100 years old. Over 100 years old. So let's first, let's take a look at the backside of this. And as you can see, there's no mint mark. So we know it's a Philadelphia. So let's flip it over. And what we need to do is grab some Nicodate and we're gonna put a little blob there on the date area. And what this does is eats away at the soft metals and leaves the hard metals behind. So what it's gonna do is gonna leave the date area that's been compressed a little bit harder than the other area around it. So let's go ahead and see what date we have. All right guys, let's reveal what date we have. It's been sitting there for a minute. We're gonna go ahead and dunk this in water and see if we can get a good date off of it. All right, and can you see anything? Oh, that's clear. 19, is that 1916? I think it's 1916. Oh my gosh. It is. 1916. Look how nice that looks. Holy cow, that one came out really awesome. So yeah, guys, a 1916 Philadelphia Buffalo Nickel. Let's go over to the book and see how many were minted and what the value would have been in a really nice grade. So in the book, we look here and we go down to the 1916. And there it is, 1916. Let's look for the Philadelphia, 63,497,466 minted. So that quite a few minted there. That's a pretty common one. In just good shape, you're talking about $6. Uh, unfortunately, this one is not in good shape. We had to acid date it, which basically takes away all the value. Uh, too bad it wasn't the 1916 double die up verse. Uh, just in good shape, that one's worth $2,200. And there's a photo of it right there. That's what it would look like. And people have found them. People have found them uh, by acid dating. And they're still worth a little bit of money just because it's so rare. But guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Be sure to give a like, subscribe, share. We'll see you next time. And as always, happy hunting.